Hello everyone. In today's video, we will see how to monitor multiple projects from a master file and update it automatically. For this, we will explore the concept of sub project in Microsoft Project. Two MS project schedules we have prepared for this video. Let us open the project A file first. Here is the schedule of construction of clubhouse building. And it is a very short and crisp schedule to make you understand the feature of the sub project. And here is the another schedule project B. This is the schedule of construction of a box culvert. So if you are monitoring these two projects, then you can use the sub project feature of MS project for better monitoring. For this, we will have to create a third schedule that will be the master project schedule for monitoring. Let us create the third schedule and name it as master schedule. After opening this, what we will do to go to the project tab from the ribbon here and we'll click on the sub project feature. And here you will see the schedules you have created after going to the appropriate folder. You can press the control button from your keyboard and select both the files and click on insert. And you will see that both these projects have been inserted in the master schedule. If you go to the project A, that is the clubhouse building schedule, you will see the total duration is 175 days. And the project B is 117 days. And in this master schedule also, these two durations are being reflected. Now, if you click on the left corner, you will see all the tasks that were in the original schedule which you have imported to this master schedule file. All the tasks has been imported here with their respective predecessors. And if you have entered the resources, that also have been imported along with the task. This is the project B and this is the project A. So that you can rename from here. If you change any of the duration or the predecessors of any task, that will reflect in the original schedule. Suppose you change here the duration of the excavation to 7 days and you change this predecessor as 4FS plus 2. Then let us check in the original schedule of project B whether this changes has been reflected. So we are opening the project B and you see here the excavation duration has been changed to 7 days and the link has been changed to 4FS plus 2 days. So you can save this from here and the changes will be reflected in your original schedules. And if you track the project A and project B original schedules in their respective files, I mean in this file, then the same effect will be reflected in the master file also. So after every time you are getting the track schedule from someone who is doing it for, on your behalf, you can ensure that the file names are project A and project B. That is same with your original files and replace the files there. And you can open the master schedule file and get the summary at one place. Now you can see one thing that if these projects are correlated, maybe you are using the same resource for these two projects and you need to correlate the task of one project to the task of the another project. Suppose you have only one excavator and you want to link the excavation of the clubhouse building with the excavation of the box culvert. You cannot do this in the general way that uh, we take when we want to link two tasks of the same project. Suppose you put it, the task number here is 2 but that is of the construction of box culvert schedule and here the task number is also 2 but it is of a different project. So if you place 2 here, it will show you an error and uh, will tell you that you cannot make a task a pre predecessor of itself because the task ID 2 for this project is excavation itself. Okay, so if you want to link 
a task from another schedule i mean this task if you want to link with this task then you have to do something else you have to press the control key from your keyboard and select both the tasks go to the task tab and from here you need to click on this button which is which says link the selected tasks and alternatively you can click on the control plus f2 also here you can now see one change that is that this task has a different predecessor and it has created a link with the excavation task of the construction of box convert schedule so this way if you check in the gantt chart at the site you'll also see there is a link has been created from the excavation task of the box culvert schedule with the excavation task of the cloud house building schedule so this way you can link two tasks of different projects with this feature of ms project and if you save this there will be a dialog box asking if you want to save your changes to project a as well if you click on yes then the changes will be saved to the sub project files also now you if you close this you will see that the link has been created in the original file also this is a very useful technique of linking two projects if you are having shared resources you can also create a resource pool for multiple projects that you handle and we will see this feature in another video so if you have found this video useful for monitoring your projects please give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you have not done it already thank you very much